Bradley Beal. Let's get straight to it. Bradley Beal is under police investigation for battery after he was involved in a confrontation with a heckler post game uh, last week. Uh, so Beal knocked off the fan's hat after the fan yelled, "You effed me out of thirteen hundred UF." Believe uh, Beal believed that this comment was disrespectful and told the fan, "Keep it a buck. I don't give a f about none of your bets or your parlays, bro. That ain't even why I play the game." I ain't gonna lie, people gotta like, you know, relax with the parlay. Like, first off, with the whole battery situation, this should not be a big deal. Like, you got your hat knocked off. It's, it's not that deep. It's just a little hat, my brother. <laughs> relax. I don't know if you have to press charges. I'm not really a law type of dude. But, like, there should just be no need for an investigation. It's the end of the season, you know what I'm saying? So, like, I don't, there's probably no suspension coming. At least I would hope not. You know, imagine you just get suspended for the last game. It's kind of weird, Adam Silver. I don't think he will. You know, he only gave John Moran eight games. If Bradley Bill gets suspended for this, I don't know what we're looking at, my brother. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I feel like sports betting kind of ruins, probably ruins the game for some people. You know, they're only watching the game just so they can see if they're winning. It's not even, and then, like, you know, it's a bunch of hatred if you mess up their parlays or you don't win them the bet. I, I, I understand it from both sides. You know, you want to get the money and obviously that, but, like, you don't got to just attack somebody personally for not like you know what i'm saying you the one who's risking your money my brother i feel like you see that with a lot of nba fans well quote-unquote fans i feel like that's probably where more of the casual audience comes from which is smart by the nba to do that you know what i'm saying Sport, sports betting is smart i can't lie because it brings in more viewership like it, it, it makes sense I, I wouldn't stop it you know what i'm saying it's just like you know some people just got to know your place you know but uh shams expects that damian little and the blazers will have serious conversations about what's next for both sides Will the trade finally come? Will Dan finally run from the grind? I hope so. I feel like Portland needs to just trade him really and just go into like a full rebuild. You know, Shaden Sharp has actually been playing pretty good lately. Uh, since you know Dame is out of the lineup, you know, because he knows the season's over. Uh, if I'm, you just gotta like trade him and just go into a full rebuild. Let Anthony do his thing. Shaden Sharp get better. You know what I'm saying? They got some decent young players on their team, so I feel like that's what they should do. Tank, get the first, get the um, high draft picks for the next few years, and boom, you'll be right there and trade Dame to a nice little team who could play, you know, and contend. But other than that, I'm going to catch you in the next one.